This is Prince Handley coming to you with 100,000 watts of pure healing love. I want to talk to you today about healing for all sickness and disease. In order to receive help, you must first realize you have a need. But this is not enough. You must also know and be confident that there is a solution for your problem and that this solution, the answer, is attainable. The answer must also be attainable by means of access. That is, can you interface with the answer, or do you have a connection? Is the source affordable? Is the solution legal? Is the help available? Is the resource or the cure within a reasonable proximity? Many people, if not most, are confused about the origin of sickness and disease and not only where it came from, but the why, the purpose it serves, if any. Many people, if not most, have been taught that everything that happens to them in life is the will of God. However, if sickness is the will of God for you, why does the Holy Bible say, Is any sick among you? Let him call for the elders of the synagogue or the church and let them pray over him anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord, and the prayer of faith shall save the sick, and the Lord shall raise him up. If sickness is the will of God for you, then it is sin for you to go to the doctor, or to take medication, or to pray for healing, or to try to alleviate the condition by any means. Messiah Yeshua taught that human conditions evolve from either of two sources, Satan or God. In the Brit Hadashah in the Jewish New Testament, in the book of John, chapter 10, verse 10, we read where Yeshua said, The thief, or Satan the devil, only comes to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But I, Yeshua, came that you, the people on earth, may have life and may have it more abundantly. If you know Messiah Yeshua personally, you do not have to be bound by sin, sickness, or disease. Because of the Edenic curse which resulted from Adam's sin in the garden, you are going to face three things in your lifetime. Sin, sorrow, and death. Three strikes and you're out. But the good news is that if you know Messiah Yeshua personally, as your Lord, you can have victory over all three, plus eternal life. The devil wants to steal from you, my friend. He wants to kill you. He wants to destroy you. But Yeshua, or Jesus, wants to give you life abundantly here on earth and in heaven for eternity. Sickness and disease are not the will of God for you. You can be healed today. In the Tanakh, the prophet Jeremiah tells us that the Lord says, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? There is no sickness, no disease, no sin too hard for God to do away with, my friend. He loves you so much today, and that's why he sent his son, Yeshua HaMashiach, to die on a cruel cross stake and pay for every sin you've ever done and purchase your healing. In the Brit Hadashah, in the book of Acts, chapter 10, verse 38, it tells us that God anointed Yeshua of Nazareth with the Ruach HaKodesh, the Holy Spirit, and with power, who went about doing good and healing all that were oppressed by the devil, for God was with Yeshua. Notice it says, healing all who were oppressed by the devil. Not some, not part of the people, but Yeshua healed all of them that came to him for healing. And in the Brit Hadashah, the Jewish New Testament, in the book of Hebrews, chapter 13, verse 8, it tells us, Yeshua HaMashiach, or Jesus the Anointed One, is the same yesterday, today, and forever. What he did when he was on earth, he'll do for you today, my friend and he'll do it tomorrow and in the future. In the Tanakh, in the Psalms, we read in Psalm 103, Praise the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Praise his holy name. Praise the Lord, my soul, and don't forget all his benefits, who forgives all your sins, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from destruction. And my friend, what God did for the children of Israel, he still does today, if you'll call upon him. He'll do it in the future if you call upon him, because in the Tanakh, in the book of Malachi, chapter 3, verse 6, it says, For I, the Lord, do not change. Therefore, you sons of Yaakov are not consumed. If you need healing today, my friend, from sin, sickness, or disease, the Lord is waiting to heal you right now. Ask him. If you do not know him, then pray this prayer. 
God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Avraham, Yitzhak, Ve'akov, if Yeshua, or Jesus, is really my Mashiach, then reveal him to me. I want to know him personally as my Lord. Please forgive my sins and heal me. Help me to live for you here on earth, and take me to heaven to be with you when I die. My friend, if you want literature to help you grow in your walk with the Lord, then write me at World Services, P.O. Box A, that's A as in Aleph, or A as in Alpha, Downey, California, 90241, USA. This has been your friend, Prince Handley, coming to you with 100,000 watts of pure healing love. Baruch Abba Adonai.